Thomas Hardy was a famous British poet and novelist. He had gone to a parish in order to supervise the reconstruction of a church. When he returned from Lyonnes, which he named the parish, which, which was a name given to that place by the poet, he had two things with him: the magic in his eyes and a piece of paper in the shirt pocket. So that piece of paper contained this form. and the magic in his eyes what was the reason for that is not known to any of them shall we read the poem when i set out for linus a hundred miles away the rain was on the spray a starlight lit my lonesomeness when i set out for linus a hundred miles away what would be chance at linus while i should sojourn there no prophet does declare Nor did the wisest wizard guess what would be chance at Linus, while I should sojourn there. When I returned from Linus with magic in my eyes, all marked with mute surmise, my radiance rare and fathomless. When I returned from Linus with magic in my eyes, the first stanza tells us that the poet had visited Linus, which was hundreds of miles away from the place. The rain was on the spray when he was uh, moving to Linus there was frost rain means frost it was on the spray that means it was a winter season and uh, starlight lit some lone lonesomeness that means the tr- poet was traveling alone lonesomeness was there and what lit the lonesomeness the starlight so it was a starry night and that starly starry night actually gave company to his lonesomeness it lit his lonesomeness Again, the poet repeats repeats the first two lines. When I set out for Linus, a hundred miles away. The second stanza tells us what would be chance at Linus, while I should sojourn there. So he says that what would happen to me at Linus when I should sojourn there, stay there. So the poet is saying, what happened to me at Linus when I stayed there? Can anyone make a guess? No. No prophet does declare. No prophet can ever dare to declare that this thing has happened to me at Linus. No, no one can do that. Nor did the wisest wizard guess. Even the wisest wizard cannot guess what had happened to me at Linus. What should be chance at Linus? Why I should sojourn there? Again, the first two lines are repeated from second stanza. And what does the third stanza tell? When I return from Ma- Linus. that magic in my eyes all marked with mute surmise my radiance rare and fathomless when i returned from linus with magic in my eyes okay so when i returned from linus there was magic in my eyes so everyone were making a muted guess muted guess they were not asking me what happened to me at linus but they were guessing what could be the reason for the glow in my eyes and also the radiance which was fathomless fathomless means which could not be measured there was that much radiance in me which could not be measured so everyone was wondering they were guessing what could be the reason of that again the first two lines of the third stanza are repeated again while i returned from linus with magic in my eyes so the poet says that there had been something at linus which created a glow in his eyes which created radiance in him and no one could ever guess what it had been Hope you understood the poem children thank you